Hello, it's Cathy and we're playing Hogsworth Legacy and we're gonna continue with the main story and doing side quests as well. In today's lesson, we will cover a truly thrilling event. The Goblin Rebellion of 1752 and all its triumphant tragedy. But more specifically, uh, we will address the devastating effects it had on the wizard milling industry. Throughout the many goblin battles, countless wizard cloaks were lost. Actually, we do know the number. 632. But history occurs outside the classroom. And look, it's time for my constitutional. One can practically osmose the history flowing through Hogwarts. I think the professor wants us to follow him. And now for a stroll to the bell tower entrance hall. Along with the rest of the castle, it was completed in the late early Middle Ages. The hall and the bell towers that loom above it contain myriad interesting artifacts. Good to see you again. Recovered from that nasty bout of dragon pox, have we? I, uh, that wasn't me, Professor. I'm new here. Are you? Well, then, uh, welcome. No doubt you're eagerly anticipating my analysis of various wizarding councils, codes, statutes, and, of course, goblin rebellions. Not all goblins are rebellious. Some venture into wizarding politics, such as Irgit the Ugly, some are talented artisans, such as Bragbore the Boastful. Did you say Bragbore? I know that name. Lodgok said he was an ancestor of Ranrock. Hmm. Well known for his metalwork. I would imagine much of his goblin wrought iron and silver has survived to this very day. Well, where were we? Back to our class topic for today. Various students can find him on display here in the bell tower entrance hall. Introduce themselves to this hero. Oh, yes. I see you found Grimbold Weft. Yes, I rather... The thrill of the scholarly pursuit. Now, let's turn our attention. He's also nearby. Revelio. Standing in eternal but symbolic watch over the bell tower is a How retinue nice you, of loyal knights. Sir Skagglethorpe the Heedless once challenged a mountain troll. These bits of broom are all that's left of a witch called Selene Wartnothy. Rumor has it she was demonstrating her experimental apparition charm. She was never seen again. Perhaps she succeeded. I suppose we'll never know. Combat, nor by slaying bloodthirsty dragons. Revelia. Rather in training yards and sculleries. Warm and approachable demeanor was celebrated by old This friends. unassuming smudge is rumored to be the location of the very first successful union. I suppose successful is a relative term, since whoever cast it didn't live to tell the tale. The Hogwarts founders could never have achieved such architectural majesty without the aid of powerful magic. Sir Af this Rebellion. is a centuries-old likeness of Pangadon. Fearless mouse hunter and devoted study companion. People have always loved their pets. I find that comforting. Abandoning class to wander the halls is in keeping with Professor Bin's manner of teaching. He 
in all the centuries that Hogwarts has existed. Not once has it collapsed. Our students often complain about the... Professor Binns, I found the statue of Sir Afpuddle. Ah, well done. Alas, Sir Afpuddle's affability was his undoing. Died instantly trying to befriend a basilisk. Eye contact is not always to be encouraged. So beloved was he that even some goblin. Of course, that did not bode well with the rest. Goblins and wizard kind will never trust each other. Yes, well, it takes a cauldron. Mm, history does tend to repeat. Wise students such as yourself. Hello, Deke. Professor Weasley said you had an idea. Indeed, Deke does. Uh, uh, Deke knows that you want to learn about all sorts of beasts. And Deke recently heard rumors of a phoenix nest in a nearby mountain. A phoenix nest? I wonder if it belongs to the phoenix Natty mentioned, the one Harlow and the poacher pack are after. Deke would not doubt it. If Deke has heard of it, surely the nasty poachers have as well. Well, I'd better go and rescue it then, hadn't I? Deke thinks so. So majestic. Deke is not sure why, but Deke feels that saving a phoenix might help to make amends for what happened with... Deke hopes that you are able to find the phoenix Most pleased to be included. Revelio. Blockade. Brookwood's poachers are already here. Revelio. being there. Incendio. Rebellion.
Revelio. Oh, should have stayed at the castle. Your poaching days are over, Avelio. More poachers? How many are there? Can't figure out why there's such a fuss about it. Seems as if it wants me to follow it. I need to find it before the poachers do. Revelio. It's shameful what you've done to helpless beasts.
Elohimora. again. Revenue. Rebellion. The victory of Enya.
Revelio. Ravenia. Confringo. I'm here to help. I can take you somewhere safe. Let's get you back to the room. Deke's going to be pleased. Rebellion. How many beasts you have here? Did you find the phoenix? Yes, Deke. And I rescued it from the poachers. I have it here. It's safe. Remarkable. Well, what are you waiting for? Deke cannot wait to... What a beauty. You keep it close. Professor Weasley and Deke were right to tell you about the Room of Requirement. Look at all you've done, and how many beasts you've rescued. A phoenix... I couldn't have done it without your help, Deke. Thank you. Uh, Deke is grateful for the kind words. Helping you do such good for so many beasts has given Deke a sense of peace Deke hasn't known in years. Deke will always be here for you when you... Is everything all right? Oh, bless you. Oh, thank you for that. It's my dear friend, Hazel. Hazel? Yes. Oh, she's a... She doesn't like to leave the forest, so I visit her once a week to brush out her... Well, the last time I saw her, Hazel, loyal friend that she is, leapt... I'm sorry to hear that. I want to help her, but she seems to have gone into... I know you Hogwarts students learn a fee. Perhaps you could find my unicorn friend. How did you become so... It was luck, truly. I came across her when she was a little golden foe. Oh, she trusted me straight away. Oh, I do hope she'll be all right. You... But I'm terrified those poachers will want her for her blood. To keep... I'll keep an eye out. If you... Oh, you have a good soul. I don't know precisely where she is, but... And although I haven't been able to brush her lately... Remember, you'll know her by her brilliant... Revelio.
Oh, no, you don't. Everything's all right now. Hazel back to a vivarium now. I should let Madame Bugbrook know she's safe. Did you find my pointy pole? Madame Bugbrook, I found your unicorn friend, Hazel. Oh, what a relief! Is she... We're both fine, and I have a safe place for her at Hogwarts. You have a kind heart, you do. I'm relieved and thankful that you'll take care of her. I shall miss my sweet pointy pony, but I know sh Take good care. A lost relic from a catacomb which requires a dark sacrifice. I know how it sounds, but if this can help you, it's worth the risk. Does Ominous know about this? He helped find the scriptorium where we discovered Slytherin's spellbook. <sighs> Very well. If Ominous will be there, I'll meet you. We don't have much time. Solomon wants to leave Feldcroft. What? Leave? Never mind. You need to stall him. Buy us time, Anne. Please. I shall do my best. I'll be in touch. Solomon can't take Anne from Feldcroft. Where would they go? When would I see her? Sebastian. I can't believe my uncle wants to leave Feldcroft. Anne's going to stall him. She must. We need time. Time? For what? I've learned more about the relic. I cross-referenced Slytherin's spellbook with everything in the library on relics and dark sacrifices. That's when I realized something. I believe the relic will only work inside the catacomb. So we have to get Anne to the catacomb and then conduct a sacrifice? Seems... risky. It'll be worth the risk. Our biggest hurdle may be convincing Ominous. And we'll only give this a chance if he's on board. And we have to keep all of this from your uncle. If he goes to the headmaster, we could be expelled. Let me handle Ominous this time. As for my uncle, he's not an aura anymore. What he doesn't know, well, won't hurt. Do you think your uncle would tell anyone at the Ministry about all of this if he found out? If he found out, I doubt he'd go to the Ministry. He didn't part ways with them well from what I... He won't say. But I believe his strong aversion to dark magic has something to do with his time there. Anne thinks he once decided to fight fire with fire, so to speak, and resorted to using an unforgivable curse and fight against dark wizards. At least that's what she thought she heard. When he realized what his job had led him to become, he left rather abruptly. So, I'm not sure he'd go to the Ministry. Good luck with Ominous, and... I shall let you know when the four of us should meet at the catacomb. Look for my owl. Coast. I received your owl. Thank you. I'm glad you came. I spotted droves of Ranrock's loyalists coming up from the coast. Overheard one of them say they're headed to another cavern, like the one we found. How are they still one step ahead of us? They can't know about the triptych. I don't know. I did see another memory. This time it was a keeper named Neve Fitzgerald. She was unnerved by Isadora's use of ancient magic. But I still can't be sure. These keepers are playing games with you. You need... It doesn't work like that. To access each of these memories, I have to complete... They're showing me the memories in a particular order. They... Oh, either they don't trust you, or you don't care enough about Anne to ask... Of course I care, Sebastian. We've come this far. Don't let your frustration get the better of you. Fine. I'll defer to your keeper friends, for now, but I don't like it. 
We don't have a choice. Now, shall we see why the triptych led us here? Let's go, quickly, before we're spotted. Keep a close eye out. I saw some of Ranrock's crew moving off the path just ahead. I wonder why. Raiding, I imagine. This mountain used to safeguard local hamlet valuables. But it's been abandoned ever since Ranrock took hold of the coast. Revenia. Loyalists deserve the Rebellion. same fate. Nice work. <laughs> Thestrals overhead. Some consider them a bad omen. Hmm. Not everyone does. I know that. <sighs> All right. I'm making small talk. I'm not going to trek up this mountain in silence. Revelio. I'm sorry we can both see Thestrals. Certainly not something I'd hoped we'd have in common. Kill any of trespass. There they are. Let's go. Wait, we should have some sort of plan. I'm through planning. I was thinking about dead goblins. You could have got us killed. But I didn't. Looks like Branrock's loyalists were heading further up the path. Let's keep going.
Ravenia. Revenia. Ramrock's gonna make everyone pay. Anything made from goblin silver belongs to us. Whether it's a sword or a repository, whatever that is. Did you hear that goblin? Ridiculous notions of ownership. of you to stop by. All of Ranrock's loyalists deserve the same fate. Rebellion. Nice work. Lumos. Repairer. I agree. Only good wizards are dead wizard. Revenue. Red Rock's got that right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> achieve his goals in that regard. Wait. Wait? For what? Listen to me. I know you're angry and frustrated, but charging ahead now could undo all the progress we've made. Lodgok said... Oh. You're... Go Stop it. That's enough. Not all goblins are like Ranrock. I am not the enemy. We want the same thing, to find answers. I thought we wanted the same. We do. Listen to me. He told me that Ranrock somehow knows about the Keepers and is searching... That's why they always seem to be one step ahead. I know what I'm doing. You need to trust me, or I don't see that we can continue together. Fine, fine. I'm sorry. I'm letting my emotions get the better of me. And I have been for a while. I do trust you. And I don't think I can help Anne without you. Good. Ranrock clearly knows more than we thought. We have our work cut out for us. We need to work together if we're going to find the... Rebellion. Agreed. Intrepid travelers, the both of you. Keep your wits about you.
Revenia. Rebellion. Revenia. So far, so good. Charming. Spiders. How fitting. Revenia. Rebellion. One nudge and that chest might have fallen. Oh, I think three nudges at least. Spiders are determined to make a meal of us. I'm sure we taste better than a goblin dinner. Revelio. A staircase leading here. Whatever for? I don't think anyone's been here for ages. Incendio! 
Velia. Confringo. Revelio. Confringo. Revelio. Look at this place. Not really my style. A bit much, if you ask me. have been the only challenge. Perhaps we should search for runes. Incendio! Is finding these chests Rebellion. luck or ease? We've seen rune symbols like these before. enough. Journal entry. We should look for more. Why couldn't she have kept all our journal entries in one place? Angry troll to bring friends together. Revelio. Confringo. 
Ravenia. Incendio. That troll certainly made a mess of things. Debris everywhere. Ravenia. That was Rebellion. a piece of work. More than one. The Jammer entry. Isadora was here. I'm out of breath after all of those stairs, but the view, well worth it. Another barrier. We can blast through it, I'm certain. This can't be a dead end. Must be another floor above us. Confringo! Ah, almost as good as if I'd done it myself. Good news. Rebellion. This journal entry sounds worrisome. Incendio. Good news. Rebellion. This journal entry sounds worrisome. can't have belonged to only Isadora. But the triptych pointed us here. Huh. 
Revelio. Another rune symbol. Feel as if I should be fluent in runic language by now. Confringo! Isadora must have honed her skill with ancient magic here. I know from the memories I've seen that the Keepers in Isadora didn't see eye to eye on the use of ancient magic. I wish you could see one of her memories. to the triptych. We've done it! Isadora should not have had to keep all this secret. I know from the memories I've seen that the Keepers in Isadora... But I don't understand why she seems to have gone to such great lengths to tell her story without their knowledge. I wish you could see one of her memories. So do I. Perhaps completing the triptych will shed Rebellion. more light on all of this. I cannot believe the journey this trip takes. Rebellion. Took us on. This is it. Well, don't keep me in suspense. Go on, place it. Another pensive. This is what we've been chasing. Bring my brother back, Father. But I can give you peace. Please, have a seat. Isadora, we are all most intrigued to hear... We're ready. I've something to show you. Father, these are my colleagues from Hogwarts. Father hasn't spoken since my brother died. On my travels, I confirm that which I've always believed. That we have the power to take away pain.
is Adora. What have you done? I took his pain. Thank you. That worked? It did indeed. Of course it did. It's goblin silver. I need something much bigger. All right. It would help if you could tell me more about what it is you're storing. Magic. Left over from a spell I devised to remove pain, but if used correctly, its power can be used to do even more good. Why would you want to store such magic away? I only need to keep it safe until I can convince my colleagues of its worth. Magic like this unnerves them. Oh, everyone's ready to wield such power. Perhaps not. Someone will be. She took away the pain. I knew it. I knew there was a way to help Anne. Something isn't right, Sebastian. What do you mean? You saw what she did. No, not the memories, the portrait. I, I think the reason Isadora hasn't appeared is because she can't. I don't follow. We have seen that view before. The abandoned home in Felcroft, the destroyed painting. It was her. So someone destroyed a bit of enchanted canvas, but we found the memory. Yes, yes, you're right. We saw what she wanted us to see. We saw what she could do, what you can do. I don't know how to do what Isadora did. Well, then you shall learn. The Keepers can teach you. I'm not sure that they would. The Keepers believe that removing someone's ability to feel pain... It's a highly complicated, unpredictable form of magic. One that should be wielded with great care. If at all. If at all? You've overcome all of their challenges. You've more than proven yourself. You can wield it. You have the ability. Please, talk to the Keepers. If not for me, then, then for Anne. want to keep Isadora quiet? Why destroy her portrait? Continued with more of the uh, main story and we found out that Sebastian's quest also is interlinked with the main quest of the protagonist. So we're gonna continue in the next video. Thank you all for watching. Wish you all well. See you in the next video.